say that they do or they don't, right? right? I can't really speak on that. I think both do uh, to some degree, right? Um, because I've seen it on both ends. Man. I've seen a woman She's get out of a relationship man. and jump into another one. I've seen a man do the same thing. So right. Right. I can't just say a man or a woman thing. I just think that's what just about an yourself? individual type of thing. So, so do they move quickly in general though? So men and women do they move quick or do it they? Just depends on what that person or do is they sit for? with it? Do they sit with the hurt? They're like, nah, fuck that. I'm finna go do. Men can't sit with the hurt. I know for me, mm. I'm not sitting with the hurt no more. I'm right. out. Mm. So you're not sitting with the hurt. You fuck all that hurt to, shit. I used to sit with the hurt and mm-hmm. try to, you know, right. figure that out and work on that, but not anymore. Right. So, so after, after you, after you broken up with, in, a, in a relationship, you've been... I think about the times you've been through relationships and mm-hmm. y'all separated, y'all know it was done. Okay. What did you do in those processes to heal? Because a lot of people mm-hmm. don't, don't realize that healing is very important. Mm-hmm. So what was your like your um, process of becoming okay. learning and right. becoming better within that relationship? Or with learning from that relationship and like, okay, I'm gonna be this next time mm-hmm. when it's time for me to be in another relationship. Mm-hmm. Well, for me, I just need to try to get more of an understanding of myself, get in tune with me. Um, So focusing more on myself, also trying to understand where I may have been a problem within that relationship, Mm -hmm. you know? So you have to ask yourself questions sometimes and say, what could you have done differently Mm -hmm. within that relationship? Not always pointing the finger at the other individual, even when... You know, you know for a fact that individual has taken you through some things. You still have to ask yourself and do some self-reflection right. and just see if there's anything that you want to work on and to better yourself. So for me, that's what I've been doing, um, especially with me going through my personal situation. Right. I've just been more so getting in tune with me and asking God to lead the way. And you know what I'm saying? I just get to, in tune with him more than anything, not the individual. That's so um, that's I'm in prayer. I'm in prayer more than anything. So I pray for my man. Um, I'm already praying for him. I'm praying for my new husband already. Um, And what I want that to to look like in the next situation. And also asking God to make sure that I'm completely healed so that I don't take that into the next relationship. Mm, Definitely. Should not to be completely healed. Absolutely. Uh, Well, does having... Well, you're gonna have the you're gonna have that 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 uh, that external baggage that the baggage that they can see, that you bring meaning like the next, yeah. uh, kids mm-hmm. or you know. Mm-hmm. But is it good to 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 bring baggage? That means like you got no. you have you have relationship wounds, meaning that you no. have experience, no. so you know. So. No. Not other, wounds. What's relationship experience is different, but right. relationship wounds is is harmful. Okay. I because see because if if it's a wound, mm-hmm. it's not even it's healed not yet. Okay. But gotcha. I yeah. wonder, can we be? Sometimes I ask myself, right? There may be. A well, not wounds, but scars. Not, then. Okay. Same thing. Okay. But no, you got battle scars. It's not they they healed, but they okay. you know, so they can notice that. So oh man, mm-hmm. so you went through this. Yeah. Come okay. Well, I've been through this. But scars heal. But. You know, you know. still got the outer right. Or, it's there, you know what I'm but they're yeah. healed. Yeah, they, they they've healed, but the other person will notice that the scar. Right, but mm-hmm. and they'll, but they'll they notice that, but it's they'll, still they'll, they'll, healed. Of course, and they'll share that 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 experience. Right, because it's with healed the, with the other because you healed. Yeah, it's gonna show. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But yeah. it's it's healed. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's it's a, it's a scar that's healed. Like mm-hmm. you've you've seen it. You know that you're gonna recognize that. You're not gonna do mm-hmm. that Again, in this right. new relationship. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. that's why it's a scar. You know what but it's healed. Mm-hmm. It's, it's it's not gonna affect you no more. You know what I'm saying? So what if a person that you know, not completely healed from a situation um, that you like so much or you now in a relationship with and you know her past experience, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Um, would you help her to heal within that process? You can you help, what? but you, no, can, yeah. you can help, but it's ultimately up to that said person to heal themselves, right? Okay. To, to go through their own process. Okay. Because 
a lot of people say, well, we can't heal together. I kind of don't agree with that. Even therapists say that shit. I don't like, I don't agree with that. Mm. I kind of think you can help somebody heal mm. if they're doing their own therapy outside of you or right. they got coming and bringing right. it together. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Because um, it's like a, especially if said person ain't never been through this heal, never known how to heal, mm. and this person has, then this person can see how they're getting themselves better for you mm-hmm. then right. you're going to want to do that for them if you really love them because mm-hmm. I mean getting if you really love getting themselves better for you the other individual versus yourself mm-hmm. right so I think you need to so but I mean, you're you're doing it ultimately for you, but also it's making you yeah. better for that person. Mm-hmm. Ultimately, you okay. know what I'm saying, okay. right? And but I mean, it's oh, wow. it's a it's a um, it's a I mean, goddamn, what, 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 why can't it be teamwork and in, in healing? It, is, it should be. If you I, really want to be together, become judgmental. If you really want to be together, if you really want to be together. That's why I asked you that. Mm-hmm. That's why I said, yeah, like, is, would you be willing to help that person to heal? Absolutely. I mean. You know? Versus yeah. judging and I mean, you, 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 I ain't gonna help everybody. You just fucked I ain't up. You, say that you, help <laughs> you just fucked up. Like, shit. Like, yeah, well, yeah, that's that's fuck fuck around. She <laughs> been dragged to the motherfucking dirt, the mud. <laughs> Nigga, somebody just left her at the cemetery to pick her up. Oh, all that. Shit, I can't do nothing with her. Oh, so here's a good question right here. Mm-hmm. Do women of today still appreciate a take charge man? So if I can grab, I like I got this, be yeah, still. Take charge. Yeah. That right, goes back to me that, seeing. I mean, it's, 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 it's an analogy, me. right? For me, you know, all for men. Me. That's that, that. That's exactly where it goes back to. I want the man to lead. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I want you to be all men, baby. Because I'm gonna be all women. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so you put news in this bitch. Absolutely. Ba. Yes. <laughs> two up, two down. Right. Oh, two up, two down. Okay, I like it. Like it. Damn, I did two down. This nigga, this nigga thought he was us. He did piece up eight times down. <laughs> Twice. Uh, I'm getting out. <laughs> So, oh man, read the question, dog. So, so, yeah, read the question. Read the one with the with the multiple choice. I like oh that. Oh my gosh! Really? You want, you want to wait for that one? Okay, go ahead. Do your thing. I'm almost. I'm almost. I'm almost there though. Yeah, do your thing. I'm do almost there. Do your thing. Do your thing. <laughs> that shit was funny. That was a good. Oh, uh, what physical masculine characteristics are most attractive to women? Physical masculine. What characteristics? Yeah. What physical masculine characteristics? That's a good question. Are most attractive to you? Physical, masculine characteristics, characteristics are the most attractive to me. Mm. I like when my nigga take my trash out. Like, bitch, what? Fucking masculine? I want that. I don't take out my trash. You know? Jesus no. Christ. My husband always does that. Oh, okay. Trash. Yeah, that makes sense. And now my son is taking out the uh, trash. <laughs> so you good. You good. So Mama. Mama. <laughs> you got to. Your... <laughs> what? What? <laughs> <laughs> I want. Um, I want a guy. Why are you so childish? Like, I don't right, know. No, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Think straight with you guys. No, 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 no. Go <laughs> ahead. We child. Why are you so fucking childish, bro? Okay, okay, go ahead. What physical masculine characteristics are the most attractive to women? What would you um, say? What boy? I, I don't. I would say. I don't know. It goes back to for me um, that leadership. So a man that takes control within yeah. the household. Yeah. Um, right. You're submissive. Per- I, are you? submissive to a degree what do you mean by to a that? degree what do you mean by that because some guys get that word misconstrued like so what exactly do you mean by that if he's okay. leading right then you're going to submit right i'll yeah yeah right. so it's, you, it's done so the right way now i'm not about to down foreign now how do you know it's done the right exactly way? like I mean, for you, it's for you. Right. It's for what okay. you want. You okay. you set the tone for what you want. I can't mm. tell you what you mm. want. Only you know what you want. Yes. What mm-hmm. you want and what I want is going to be totally two different totally. things. And if he's setting the, the tone for something that you want, Absolutely. you don't want, then it ain't going to work. Yeah, if it's not what I want, then it's not going to work. Absolutely not. Damn. You not see what I'm saying? Wow. Oh, man, 
sense. But Ish. I am willing to Ish. compromise Ish. if it makes sense. Okay. Hold okay. on, calm wow. down before you go there. That's a okay. plus. I can come. Oh, I was going there. Yeah, I see you went there. I was heading to Wawa. And I brought your ass right back. Okay? I was heading to Wawa. Are they here? A lot, of Wawa. <laughs> a lot of women say compromise, but about Wawa. they do yeah. not. They, they do not use the word compromise. They know what the word compromise is, but they don't use the word compromise. Yeah. So to hear you say that is yeah. that's refreshing. No, no, but a lot of women don't like to hear submissive. Yeah, they don't. Uh, they hate that word. I mean, it just depends on how it's being used. Mm -hmm. right. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? So some people look at the word submissive as doing everything that the man asks for and he requests. Yes. Um, yes. But also, what exactly is that man doing right. for that woman to be willing to Submit. Is he able to lead? Is he able to provide? Is he mm. able to show love and affection? Um, all of those things, you know. So, right, 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 right. and is he giving a good deed? <laughs> so I'm just saying, we not gonna take, we not gonna erase that and act like that's not important. Come on, in. This? Oh, we can't do our kid. That's sex gotta be good. We can't do our kid. Okay, I don't care. What y'all ladies huh? say about me too? Y'all know sex matters. Yes, yeah, sex, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, definitely. Yeah, sex, 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 so you got to pick one. Yeah. Ladies, you only can pick one. Let's see what they say. Y'all can comp y'all can post in the comments later on about how you feel about the question. Here mm -hmm. we go. Mm -hmm. If you had to choose one type of man, <laughs> which would it be and why? Here we go. So a guy with big brains, big ears, smart. That means she wants to be heard. Mhm. Mm a person with a big heart. That means she wants to be felt. She wants to be loved. Big honesty. So she don't like liars. She don't like she don't like the liars at all. Big bodyguard. Protector. She wants to be protected. She wants to be protected by him. Uh big bankroll. She wants that money. That's all she care about. That money. Or a big dick. She wants to be dicked down. I'm, I'm really happy how you just said that shit with like conviction. Oh Go my God. Go ahead, bro. Mm. You gotta pick one. Big brains, big heart, big honesty, big bodyguard, big bankroll, or big dick. This question is some bullshit. Why is it simple? It's Get on my ass later, ladies. It's what? You gotta pick it's one. It's some bullshit. Who no. the fuck want a made up ass man with you know, like, you can only pick one thing about this made-up ass man. Like, okay, pick one, then pick three. Who the three. fuck is doing that? Pick one, then Ladies, pick three. Ladies, what the fuck you want a man oh with a big God. heart, big brain, big bang, big dick? Like, what you the want fuck? You all that up. All of that shit. Come on in. Wait, nigga, we can't get out. You can't get your cake and eat it, too. Okay. The fuck I can? Shit. <laughs> but I guess for the show. Thanks. Yeah, yes, because it's our show. For the show. Yeah, it's y'all show. <laughs> I didn't make it. I mean, no, no. I mean, I have to. Shut that up! Oh my god, guys! I'm gonna go with um, what's the one with the liar? Big honesty. I'm big gonna go honesty. with big honesty. It's not what you said earlier. Yes, <laughs> I, I said big dick, big bank, big heart. Mm. So that's so that's a three. I want all. Of that. So, if, so if you want three, if you had three, you'll take bank, bank. What else? Heart. Honesty. Heart. Oh, heart. she oh, said honesty. bank, bank honesty. honesty, and heart. Really? Yeah. So you got a small or a regal? You got to be good. Big, big this is not fair. This is not right. I want. And you didn't even say bank. Did she say bank? I did. She, she said bank. She did say bank. Heart, all of that. Honesty. I want all you of that. So you know what? Big if you could put together big. your ideal man, what character traits? Would he get? Oh, and no, see, I helped you, you out. I just helped you out. All of that shit in the inside. If you could put together your ideal, what character traits would he get? All of that in a man that accepts me that... for me completely. Hmm. Shout out to y'all out there that's being that to seven different bitches. 
Like, I mean, it's... As what? Huh? What? I don't think you can... I say that? I don't know, man. What did they say? Did anybody answer that question? Welcome to Disney Trail. They, they was like, they, they was nobody answered the question because everybody, it's Friday night, they got a lot drunk right now. Oh we get they answers in the they morning. They're going to come back and answer the question. Yes, we, we get plenty of answers in the morning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I guarantee they all want Big Bang. And, mm -hmm. and, uh, and uh, what else you said? Well, I need these ladies Honestly. to make sure they provide that Big Bang, too. Man, so I'm what if we saying, were to answer? Match that energy, baby. Match that energy. If you ask any woman nowadays, they want their nigga to make a hundred thousand dollars or more. Well, you I hope that lady is huh? making yeah, big too. Absolutely. Make six figures or more. Yeah. I'm there's a, oh, he can make fifty thousand dollars. I'm no, telling you, it's best can. to match Stop the man's lying. energy right now, Stop baby, to save your marriage, to save your relationship. And if she make it, well, she definitely can deal with a nigga that make fifty thousand dollars. Right. Mm. Only men do that shit. Only only we sell. Chicks be Women don't sell. Big dicks and good dicks. Anyway, oh, so that's, that's what they settle for. They settle for that shit. Mm. I don't want no man. And then be like, why he don't love me? Bitch, because he fucking you and your three homegirls. That's oh, why. Wow. What up? Chick across the street. Men lie, women lie, numbers, numbers don't, don't lie. Numbers this, don't this lie. This is the new church has model. I'm letting y'all know right now. <laughs> it's like, it's a different game right here. Y'all don't, women don't realize that shit. How can, how can a woman build up a man? Like Beyonce, him upgrade them. Yeah. I don't know. Not upgrade per se, but just build them up. So Why are they in a relationship? Encourage. Yeah. Encourage me. Absolutely. You have okay. to. You should want to speak life into your man every day. Mm. You Say that again. Speak life into your man. Speak life into your motherfucking man, ladies. Yes, absolutely. You should. Y'all should be speaking life into each other. Definitely. You Men that's speak like a twelve women. They be like, they be like, damn shit. girl, what that girl say to the child? Slap that bitch. That's us speaking life, life. into our woman. I like woman. that. I like that. That's I what like we that. doing. You know what I'm saying? Damn. Right. Oh my god. Wait, you don't agree? You don't like that? I'm good. I'm just done. <laughs> I ain't checked the fuck out. <laughs> She is yo, trucked the fuck out. Yo, she just said I am trucked the fuck out. Trucked the fuck out. Trucked the fuck out. Hey, okay. we did it, man. We did. Hey, man. First of all, first of all, she know what she's talking about. Yeah. And if you need a central massage, you need to go to her. You know what I'm saying? Fill them hands again. No, babe. We need to come and get that massage. Uh, I'm good. Uh, Humvee. Yeah. I'm in your cup, man. Come I on, do man. couples too, you guys. Men. Oh, shout out to the couple. Shout out to the freaky couples. Okay, okay. Oh my god. Men, women, and couples. Couples are my. Favorite. Wow. They be, they be like, favorite. They be like really cool and shit. Huh? Do, do, do they hold hands and shit? There's a lot going on in there. That's a lot. That's dope. That's dope. Wow. You do I men couples? Well, hey, man. Whatever couples want to come with it. Okay. Ooh. All right. Your hands are very central. <laughs> uh, what, what, how did they reach you? <laughs> <laughs> right on the page. <laughs> 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 Guess what? You know we got the executive decision maker. Oh wow! Can they see it? Can yeah, they can see it. it. They can see it. So what are all the choices? Definitely, Definitely never, never. Why not? Why not? Ask again. Ask again. Forget, forget it, it. And possibly. possibly. All right. So let me ask a question. Mm -hmm. Am I gonna get a massage from Sam tonight? Say, ask saying? again. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker <laughs> is. Oh my god! Say, uh, say, ask again. Say, ask again. Oh my god! So childish. <laughs> Where? Oh Where? Where did you get that from? Hey, I want to know. Am I gonna get a massage from Sam? The sensual. What is? What's IG? Sensual hands. Sensual touches and massage. Okay, let's ask. Why not? Oh my! Mm -hmm. Why not? You want to ask something? You want to ask him something, Sam? I'm gonna ask you something. Yeah. How about how about I'm gonna let Sam go first. Sam, no, go, go ahead. I, <laughs> I, I want to hear what you got to say. <laughs> Sam, what you trying to fucking say, Sam? Right. I just want to know what the hell you want to ask. Am I getting here tonight? It ain't. <laughs> what did he say? <laughs> What did he say? Forget it. That's your life. That's your life. I ain't getting nothing. Huh? Oh my gosh. I don't really. 
Put on. Just ask you something. Okay. Are you guys booking with me? Mm. What I do? Ask. How the hell you do? Ask. Okay, here we go. You, you, guys, you gotta say it. They said never! <laughs> Fuck out of here. I ain't checked out. Why are you checking out? <laughs> hey. I'm sad. I'm heartbroken. There it is, like guys. That. Thank you. I'm gonna I'm 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 um, <laughs> book at you. I, I'm definitely gonna book with you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> a, I don't like that. <laughs> what? Man, I'm definitely gonna book. Hmm. What's, what's Go ahead. Just, we had a great show great tonight. Show tonight. Yeah, hey, a great we show. <laughs> Put your info out there again. I'm sorry. It's Sensual Touches Massage. Sensual Touches Massage. The website is coming soon, you guys. Um, keep in mind, the business just changed from Diamonds in the Skies, and we're separating now, doing solo massages. So I am Sensual Touches Massage on IG. Hit me up. Send me a picture. Boy, I'm gonna bite my lips. I know, you're gonna start bleeding. You're gonna bleed Hey, make sure you guys continue to follow us on IG, uh -huh. on uh, on Snapchat, Twitter, Threads. We're everywhere. You're Threads, not bad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We on Threads. Hey. I ain't always on Threads. Yeah, you gotta we... add me, nigga. I ain't always on Threads. I... We everywhere. Thanks for being a fucking and make sure partner. you follow us Loser. and send us those truck facts at truckcast2018 at gmail.com. That's truckcast2018 at gmail.com. We'll see you guys next week. Yes, sir. Last time that I checked, we love y'all. Peace. Thank you. We out.